Hello everyone, due to the large storage space of the video, divided into two parts, this is the second part. Video production is not easy, I hope it can help you. I hope to get your support, subscribe, and if you need any other help, you can contact me and send me a message. Press the green button and move left and right to place the screen stencil on the Overlap the screen holes with the PCB pad. PCB position adjustment takes a little time. Once the position is determined, manually press and hold the screen stencil and click to fix it. Manually hold down the screen stencil and click on the computer to fix the screen stencil. After the screen stencil is fixed, click the access to drop it. Next, set the PCB mark data. Click on the two small circles in the opposite corner. After clicking on two of them, the approximate coordinate locations appear. Double click on the position of PCBE and the CCD moves to the coordinate position. Select the speed of movement. Movement can be made by pressing the keyboard arrow keys or by tapping the screen. Find the mark position in the CCD display. This is to adjust the brightness of the CCD. Requires clear distinction between black and white. You can also use the scroll wheel. After aligning the position, click Auto Match. The machine will automatically identify the mark point and location. Click OK. Make the second mark point. Use the keyboard to move the CCD to find the mark point. You can use another PCB to find the mark point, so that the mark point will be found quickly.
If the mark point is strange, you can do it step by step from top to bottom. This is the mark point search range. If you do not want to operate, use automatic matching. Use automatic matching, convenient. There are rust and dirt mark points below. The mark point is made, click OK. If the screen template has a mark point on it, it can be made, but our screen template does not have a mark point, so we don't need to do it. Click to confirm the PCB moves backward. In this way, the PCB printer program is basically completed but we have to fine-tune the position of this order. Open data entry, select a single PCB mark point. Because there is no mark on the screen template, choose a single photo. Open production parameter settings. Because the first PCB board needs to adjust the offset position, select these four options and it is fine. After so acting, click Confirm. This is to adjust the cleaning parameters. This is how many PCB boards are printed. Remind the operator to clean manually. Remind to manually clean the screen template. This is the automatic cleaning parameter setting. You can set how many PCBs to be cleaned. This is to clean the PCB after printing the PCB 5 times. Can adjust the moving speed during cleaning. Generally, for high precision products, only one PCB board will be cleaned once. After parameter setting, click OK. There are red cleaning methods and dry cleaning methods. After parameter setting, click OK. The other is the direction of the PCB board in and out, which is selected according to the direction of the production line. Left in, right out. Writing left out. It is okay. Coming from left, go out from left. Coming right, go out right. You can set the incoming and outgoing speed of the PCB.
If these speed parameters cannot be satisfied, they can be modified. Please remember the parameters before modifying. If you have any problems, you can change them back. These are the default parameters of the machine. If not satisfied, you can modify. This is to remind the operator how many times need to add solder. This is the parameter setting of the screen leaving the PCB. This is the parameter setting of the spraying position. Click next to set the mark point parameters. This is the parameter setting before production. After setting all parameters, select Start. The PCB board must be placed from the entrance position to avoid hitting people. After the Z axis rises, the adjustment window pops up. This is to adjust the parameters of the PCB platform because we previously placed the silk screen manually. It is used to adjust the offset position of X, Y, E, Y, R, Z axis. Observe the position of the PCB and the screen hole, click on the parameter, and check the position of the machine visually. This is the distance moved. This is to show the distance currently being moved. Generally, there is no need to move in the Z-axis direction. If the parameter adjustment is wrong, click Reset. Generally, it is adjustment, X-axis, Y-axis, -E Y-R-axis, others do not need to be modified. Be sure to observe the movement of the position while clicking.
Y R on the left, Y E on the right. It is inconvenient to observe. Click on the scraper to move backward. After the adjustment is completed, click OK and the scraper will move down. If YE, YR move at the same time, click this. Confirm that it is normal, click OK. After each printing, check the effect. If the position is offset, adjust it again until the printing is normal. It is easy to adjust the offset position and master his direction. How to install the scraper? Stop the machine before installing the scraper. One reset, one start to pause, one indicator light, and one light. You can also click stop on the computer. Click OK, an interface will pop up, reminding whether to stop. The PCB printing program is probably done. Thank you everyone.